Okay, I will now operate um, the cold water switch and then you can see uh, what happens. See when everything goes normal, no water comes out of the overflow, everything goes down the hose. I will now again uh, operate the water button and then you can see how it stops. So that, this will also take around 20 seconds so water uh, doesn't stop flowing immediately. Still hear the water coming in. Okay, now it's almost stopped, almost closed. That was the water sissing. A little bit of the water comes out. And that was that. So as you can see, no water came out of the overflow. What's important for draining this water is that there are no curbs in the draining hose and there are no height differences. So, so you don't go uh, down to the floor with the draining hose and then up again to some sort of drain because that will cause um, the water will need pressure to push it over the curb and that will cause to um, water coming out of the overflow and that's not a sustainable situation so but once uh, you have just um, put the drain draining hose in the right position everything will be fine so I hope this is uh, a little bit clear